Okay, kind of hard to video while I was doing it, but the two case, case halves are basically slipped together. I've just got a couple nuts holding it on. One here and one back here just holding it together at the moment. But we can turn the flywheel and watch the piston rods moving in and out. Of course, they're going to have pistons connected to them at some point along this process. So the next trick is to torque the nuts to hold the case actually together around the main bearings and all the extra little nuts that are all around the outside to hold the case all together. So that's our next step.